All right, what is going on guys? My name's Brian and welcome back to the Game Shower where we like to shower you with Square Enix news, leaks and rumor. But in today's video, we are going to be reacting to the Nintendo Direct Mini presentation from today. Uh, I'm really excited. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I already saw the box art for Kingdom Hearts Melody of Memories or Memory of Melodies, the mom edition, the one that's coming out for Nintendo Switch, Xbox and PlayStation on November 13th of 2020. So I'm excited to see that. Um, I'm not gonna lie to you guys it's a rhythm based melody game so i haven't been too excited but i'm hoping with this new trailer that i do get excited the box art has me like that that's just amazing it has Kyrie now in the box art right in the center just like in the all-in-one package they had sora sitting on the seat now they have Kyrie sitting on the seat looking down with her eyes kind of closed so i'm really excited to see what this presentation has to present um let's let's just dive into it like I said, I haven't seen the trailer, but I have seen the box art and I have seen that they announced the release date for Kingdom Hearts Melody of Memories. So let's jump right into it, guys. Hi everyone! Welcome to our second Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. Yeah, I you guys Today, a lot of we'll continue drawings. delivering the latest information about upcoming Nintendo Switch games exclusively from our development and publishing partners. We'll be releasing more videos in the series this year, so please be on the lookout. Okay, let's get into the headlines. Experience the music of Kingdom Hearts like never before. Stages are themed after locations from the Kingdom Hearts series and the Disney Universe. Match the rhythm with good timing to achieve high scores, and use special abilities like, to attack uh, and defeat enemies. It's not really catching my attention. A variety of modes are available, including Memory Dive, where you play stages from past memories, and Boss Battle, where you square off against fearsome foes by dodging their powerful attacks. Dude, by what? Boss battles with like music? Clearing stages unlocks a music player in story cinematics so you can relive memorable scenes from the Kingdom Hearts series. That is really cool. You get to see cutscenes, that, that's really cool. Right Compete there. against other players for high scores in online and local multiplayer. I mean, that's kind a of A free for all mode exclusive to the Nintendo Switch version also features local play for up to eight players. Maybe Mickey. Plus, experience an all-new chapter in this game. Kingdom Hearts Melody of Memory launches on Nintendo Switch November 13th. Pre-purchase begins later today. Uh, be Drop before we move on, before we move on, before we move on. This is this is what I'm talking about. Like I, I'm not too convinced on this game yet. Like they have an online multiplayer, but I, it's it's just still melody based. It's still like all right, interact with this button. I feel like I honestly feel like they took the Little Mermaid world and they said let's make it a full game, like from Kingdom Hearts two. You know your your favorite world. You you remember where you had to do a musical and it was like time with like pressing the buttons and everything i feel like this is what this game is and i just feel like uh, like it's coming a freaking nintendo switch i hope it's not a full 60 dollar game like i hope not but i feel like it's going to be will i get it i i'm not too convinced yet and y'all know me i'm a big kingdom hearts fan but this is not what i wanted for the switch like i wanted a full-on i don't even care if it was like Oh, here's Kingdom Hearts HD and oh, it only comes with part one like I wouldn't even care for that like I would have preferred that over this is what I'm trying to say like I feel like the way they're trying to get you is with putting oh there's a new story with Kyrie and like you have to play this game to experience it and I feel like it's one of those things that if you don't play this game or if you don't experience this game you're gonna be lost with the story because the Lord knows we didn't ex well I was let's not say we but I want to say many 
many people didn't experience the mobile game, the Union Cross, and it was like, oh, you didn't want to play the mobile Kingdom Hearts game? Well, guess what? Kingdom Hearts is going to be very, very trippy for you. Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to be very, very trippy for you, and you're not going to understand anything and you're gonna see a whole bunch of new characters the story's gonna get all crazy as if it wasn't confusing enough if you didn't play the mobile you're screwed so i feel like this is gonna be one of those things that if you do not play this game you're gonna be even more confused with the next kingdom hearts but yeah let's, let's move on for the rest of this direct number 13 pre-purchase begins later today